Well, hello, welcome to Addicted to Angling. Uh, last few weeks uh, since River has closed, uh, I've been fishing for tench. I've had three sessions. Uh, first session, I blanked. Second session, I went on to water that I really like. Uh, I managed to get one fish within the first three minutes. Uh, got a smaller fish later on, then it just it died. It's too early in season. Uh, they've switched on, but they've not fully switched on. Well, yesterday I got up at six in the morning, seeing I'd booked an extra day off uh, before this Good Friday. I decided to go on a club water, which holds a lot of tench. So I started fishing from six o'clock yesterday morning. And today by, I think, about two o'clock, I'd had 16 fish. I was meant to be doing it another night uh, till tomorrow. Uh, but the place were rammed and a dad and a lad turned up, a uh, young lad. Uh, they travelled about two and a half hours and young lad were upset because they were no worth at fish. And they weren't been able, with how long it would have taken them to get back to where they come from, uh, there were no time for them to go fishing, so they were going to call it till next week. So I decided to let them have my swim. Uh, he read him that he wouldn't want it. He didn't, he didn't want it uh, because he didn't want inconvenience me. But I'd had my session, uh, I'd had a lot of fish, I'd had a great time. So I thought, he's a young lad, getting into angling, uh, why not let him have his fun? I've had my fun, it's been a long time since we've all been able to go out and spend night fishing. So I've managed to get there and do it, it's his turn for to do it, so I've come home. Now the water I've been on today, uh, you're not allowed for video on uh, in my club water, to put a stop to video in. So what I'm going to do, and it's not really going to be a video of me fishing, it's just going to be this intro and I'm going to show you some pictures of fish. Um, I didn't take a picture of all fish, but I got a good few pictures and we're going to get them on here and I'm going to show you a picture of my fish from my last one. I'm only doing this video because I've had a few messages uh, saying, uh, have you packed in the videos? It's been quite a few weeks and I've said no, I've just been fishing waters that I'm not laid for video on. So I'm going to put this together now. It's not going to be the most exciting thing for watch. But this picture's involved and it's going to show them who like Tench that they are waking up. So don't sit at home thinking it's not warm enough yet. It is warm enough and they are waking enough. So get your gear out and get on them tents. I hope you enjoy. Now most of the fish that I have caught, which you'll see in pictures, uh, have been caught on CC Moor, 10 milli Pacific tuna. First time I've used it this year and all I can say is it's an awesome bait. Only way I actually bought it, I went to the shop and everybody had bought alt bait. And the last thing I got shelf was a kilo pack, I think for about 12 quid. So it for, I need some boilies, some small stuff, just in case. Picked them up, uh, first time I've used it and God, it has, it's performed, it's done some, done me some fish. Uh, the other rig I've been using uh, is an helicopter rig, I'll put a picture in. Uh, it's a Drennan large maggot feeder and a three inch up link with a piece of red foam on uh, an 18 zuck in the end of the foam so an extra 18 zuck and what you do you just pull it out at foam at end at rig put your maggots on it and push it back in pops up and it holds your, your maggots on top a bit like a medusa rig uh, that's been doing some serious damage on tench as well right what we're going to be using uh not be, going to be going through where you set it up just by looking at it, you'll know how to do it. Short up link, about three inches. Size 12 zuck. Uh, on the end, it's been threaded through a piece of foam. With a size 18 zuck on end. And what we do with that smaller cut end, just bring this down a bit. Put about three, four maggots on. Like this. Pull it back into the form, pull the point into the form. And you've got this, which will make the maggots pop up, sit like this. 
So we're going for helicopter style rig. Two float stops, number eight swivel, onto oak bank. Push them up tight. And on the end, big Drenham maggot feeder. And on the other one, we're going to put in a worm kebab rig on. Put your up went down just so it touches just the tip of the swivel. And there you go, it's as simple as that, and it's in a very effective rig. Let's see if we can get a tench on it. Before I go back work, which is Tuesday, I'm going to try and get out on a water where I am allowed to do my videos and we're going to do a tent session. The thing what annoys me most is the club I'm in have got some of the best tent waters going and it's a real shame that I can't do videos on them because what a video did make these waters but I'm just not allowed to do it and there's no point. I've waited ages getting this club so I'm not willing to operate rules. If you have watched this, please like and subscribe because the videos are going to come up, are going to keep coming. Uh, I've just got to decide where I'm going and what I'm going to do this season. Instead of just fishing my club waters, which is a lot of waters in it, I'm going to break it up so I can do the videos. Uh, I'll try and get a group of videos at once, then split them up so I can put them out and keep them going. Fish my club water, then when I'm running out of footage, I'll jump back on the waters that will allow me to get the footage. And I hope you all get out on bank soon and I hope you get a lot of tench. Cheers for watching, please like and subscribe.